having looked at the flowers i'm sure you play a little game on the playground with your friends in a circle you hold hands with your friends and you play a little game and what is that little song can you remember you stand in rings holding hands let's sing that ring a ring o roses pocket full of posies a tissue a tissue we all fall down so when you fall down you sit down say it again ring a ring o roses pocket full of posies a tissue a tissue we all fall down another rhyme for you is mary 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 quite contrary how does your garden grow and mary says with silver bells and cockle shells and pretty maids all in a row what mary says is silver bells and shell like flowers and when she says pretty maids she calls all the flowers pretty maids okay mary says it's a rhyme mary mary quite contrary how does your garden grow with silver bells and cockle shell and pretty maids all in a row lavender is another lovely pretty light purple flower and the song for that is you must be knowing already lavender's blue and it goes like this lavender's blue dilly dilly lavender's green when i am king dilly dilly you shall be queen you get lavenders in greens and purples and you can get lavender powder so let's sing the song again lavenders blue dilly dilly lavenders green when i am king dilly dilly you shall be queen we learnt the most beautiful part of any plant tree is the flower and from the flower you get the fruit and there are all kinds of fruit tiny fruit big fruit like the jack fruit tiny cherries colors fruits come in colors size shape shade some are sweet smelling very attractive to eat so we are going to do now is fruits we're going to talk about we're going to look at fruits of all kinds you love to eat fruits yes i too we all have our favorite fruit what is your favorite fruit that's a question now okay now long long ago there is a story of a king of spain's daughter she was very fond of fruits okay now she loved pears have you seen pears have you seen pear green pear golden pear they are very juicy so the story is she went looking for golden pear tree and there's a little lovely little song on nut tree i had a little nut tree okay shall we sing that i had a little nut tree nothing would it bear but a silver nutmeg and the golden pear the king of spain's daughter came to visit me and all for the sake of my little nut 
tree. I skipped over water, I danced over sea, and all the birds in the air couldn't catch me. You like it? Okay, so the nut tree song. One, two. I had a little nut tree, nothing would it bear but a silver nut, meg, and a golden pear. The king of Spain, daughter, came to visit me, and all for the sake of my little nut tree. I skipped over water, I danced over sea, and all the birds in the air couldn't catch me. Pear, and my favorite fruit is pear. It's very juicy, nice green color. You also get it in golden color. So now we're going to talk about all the fruits that you and I know. The tiniest fruit that I love to eat, the tiny red cherry. Okay, so what is the tiniest fruit? A light, tiny little cherry. Very juicy and very, very tasty to eat. Cherries are just lovely round like this. Tiny cherry, that's a cherry, okay? Now, so cherry, then what else you have? Pear, okay? Cherry, then you have pear. Next one is pear. Tiny little pear. Okay, that's a pear. Then what else? Then you have banana. Some bananas are green. Some are red. Some are yellow. So you have banana. Some are green. Some are red. And some are nice bright yellow and they are very good for health. So you have banana, papaya, papaya is another lovely fruit that's very healthy, papaya, okay, that's another lovely little fruit. Is good for our health. Then we have guavas. I'm sure you love guavas. Again, that's a nice little green fruit, but sometimes it becomes nice and yellow. Then you have mangoes. Of course, mangoes. You all love mangoes, both green and ripe. Mango. So you have mango. What else? Papaya, mango. Then you have sapota. Watermelon, what about your water, the huge, one big huge watermelon, watermelon, they are very huge ones, watermelon, then you have lovely jackfruit, jackfruit, that's the biggest fruit. Jackfruit is the biggest. Then what else? What is the color and the fruit? Same. 
the color and the name of the fruit is same what is that orange very good orange and peach peach is also a fruit orange is also a fruit but the color and the fruit is the same then you have a lovely little butter fruit full seeds inside custard apple you will love it i'm sure custard apple and then apple itself apple you love apple green apple yellow apple red apples all over you will find apples all of us love apples so custard apple peach apples of different colors now you find pear you find two colors apples you find two colors mangoes you find green and both green and ripe ones what papaya papaya inside will be nice and orange color what about a single seed sapota very good you call it chiku sapota sapota is another little brown sweet little fruit then what about the bunch the colorful bunch it comes in green and purple grapes very good grapes green grapes purple grapes grapes then you have lemon you all love lime sweet lime lemon lemon then you have sweet lime lemon family ever so many fruit then you have pick lovely pineapple pineapple very difficult to cut but very tasty to eat okay sweet lime pineapple okay then there are other fruits that can be dried like the dates which is orange in color then becomes color changes grapes when is dried we call it raisins then there are figs so there are figs fig that's a lovely little it looks something like this figs but it's when it dried it becomes different dates that's another lovely fruit dates first it is green then it becomes yellow and then it becomes orange dates so all kinds of fruits you get now what we are going to look at is we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 now we also say coconut 
coconut water you will drink when it is tender you say it is also a fruit coconut the water of it is very very tasty now we have whole lot of fruits here 20 numbers they are all colorful some are small some are big some are very colorful tasty now we need to learn the spellings of all this now i am going to ask you which is the biggest fruit supposing we say name any two any two that's what we are going to we are going to name any two name any two a large fruit b dry fruit green color fruit then d bunches fruit that come in bunches that's what we are going to look at okay now when we say in large fruit what is fruit? what is that comes into your mind large very good you say that is jack fruit jack fruit then watermelon yes next is watermelon water melon there are also other different kinds of melons also when you say dry fruit normally dates dates and grapes dates can be dried and grapes or figs can be dried when you say green color what's the green color fruit here you will say pear very good pear guava yes okay now i have put here bunches what fruit comes in bunches very good grapes and banana grapes and banana banana both come in bunches there are ever uh, other fruit which i have not mentioned here you will know okay there are many you have put down only 20 but there are many more fruits that you locally find you eat isn't it now let's look at what we have here fruits cherry that comes in bunches pear banana which comes in green yellow and red color papaya guava mangoes the ripe ones and green ones watermelon is a huge fruit jackfruit another big fruit orange and peach both the colors and the fruit name same custard apple who's got lots of seeds inside like a butter fruit there is apple sapota grapes lemon sweet lime pineapple fig dates coconut you also have what you call butter fruit passion fruit there is dragon fruit all kinds now among those name any two large fruit huge ones jack fruit watermelon dry fruit what are the fruit that can be dried fig dates grapes green color pears and guavas are green color bunches what fruit comes in bunches grapes and bananas and so on so we need learn need to name learn the spellings learn the spellings you will draw and write the spelling so that we can write our test correctly